Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're closing out the first week of February and opening up the second week. So without further ado, uh, let's go. So as usual, we're gonna start with the expenses for this week. So we have quite a lot of colors here. So let me quickly calculate a total and tell you what I spent money on. So we spent 45 on groceries, 22.84 on spending, 57.91 on dine out. 195 for health, 300 for rent, 1795 for clothing, 1208 for beauty, 217.93 for upkeep, and that's because I bought a what is it called? It's like a treadmill but for walking, so a walking mill. I don't know, but I ordered it online. I wanted one for a while, so I hope it's gonna come soon and. Yeah, it's just something that I can do while I'm on, I don't know, calls with somebody or working um, because I work from home and that means I kind of stay seated quite a lot. So it's just good if I'm going to have something to kind of keep myself uh, active. And I also uh, recently weighed myself and I gained a lot of weight. So <laughs> I want to get that off. And then 25 for gifts. So in total for this week, it was 893 euros and 71 cents. Great. So let's quickly flip through uh, the budget and we're going to walk through the actual amounts. So the actual income was 1,500, no rollover. That's what we worked with. So groceries, I know that we actually spent 45, but for the rest, I don't know. So spending has a rollover of, let's check, one, two. So that means we spent 23. And dine out has a rollover of, let's see, one, 10, 15, 16, and 17. So 75 minus 17, we spent 58. So all the rest gas, um, all the rest has the same gas, got 10, 150 in rent, 15 utilities, miscellaneous got five and upkeep 135. So in total, bills and cash envelopes was 476. So 1,500 minus 476, 1,024. Great, so short-term sinking funds, 1,024. Everything stayed the same here. Birthdays was 70. Sorry, beauty was 70, birthdays was 30. Christmas 10, clothing 30. Health 100. Holidays 5 and travel 200. So it was 445 and 1,024 minus 445, 579. 579 bringing here in long-term sinking funds also everything stayed the same so five for babies 24 car 54 deposit 220 for emergency five into pets 90 in retirement five in technology and five in weddings that was 400 so 579 minus 400 is 179 and all of that went in uh, to the savings box. So 179, it was the 160 that we budgeted and the rollover amount here. So 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19 indeed. So 179 in total and zero euros left to budget. So as in my savings box, I only have like either five uh, amounts that end with zero or five. I'm gonna move these four uh, ones into my rollover envelope and whenever we have uh, a bigger amount to stuff in here, I'm gonna stuff these as well. But today we're adding 50, oh, not 50, 15, I'm sorry. I would love to add 50, where's my marker? All of the markers are falling, 15, this one. Perfect. So that's what the box is looking like right now. Wonderful. Let me move this away. I'm going to move these rollover money. And then we are flipping through next week. And let me walk you through what we have. So we have 750 in our budget. And then we actually have some more, I think, in our rollover envelope. Let me actually check. Yes, okay, so we already have some more into our rollover envelope. And we I just added the four that we had. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we have ten and I'm gonna add them to the savings box. And then we have one euro left over. So that's I'm just gonna write as rollover. So seven fifty one. 
So these 10, I will need to exchange for a 10. Do I have a 10? Because I don't want to stuff the box with so many ones. I have a 10. Let me add it to the box. Because I have like a uh, envelope to the side where I just stuff all of the money that kind of is like a rollover. Or like the ones that I take out from envelopes and they just accumulate and then all of that I stuff into the box. So that's what the rollover amount is from. Perfect. Okay, let's go. So uh, budgeted amounts for next week. So we have 45 into gro groceries, 25 in spending, 75 into dine out, 10 into gas, 5 in miscellaneous and upkeep, 135. So 45, 25, 75, 10, 5, 135. Oops, in total it was 295. 751 minus 295, 456. Perfect. Okay, so we're bringing 456 here for short term sinking funds. Beauty is going to get 80. Birthdays 20, Christmas 10. Clothing 20, health 50. And subscriptions five and travel 50. So 80, 20, 10, 20, 55, 50, 235 in total. So 456 minus 235, 221. And then long term sinking funds we have five going into babies, 10 into car, 25 in deposit, 15 emergency. Then five into pets, 45 in retirement, and five in technologies and weddings each. So in total, that is 150. And then 221 minus 150 is 71. And that we're bringing here. And then we're putting all of the 71 into our savings uh, box. So technically we're putting 70 and then one on the side and then we're going to roll that over until we have once again an amount that either ends with five or a zero okay so that is the budget layout for next week i'm gonna be back tomorrow with a cash stuffing of this paycheck so stay tuned for that but yes i hope you liked this video if you did please give a like and consider subscribing to my channel we have fun over here i'll be back very soon with more videos but in the meanwhile i wish you a very wonderful day and i hope to see you next time bye mm -hmm.